Welcome to my channel. It's Mrs. Thinking of a Master Plan, and I'm here with the weekly meal plan for the week of June 11th through June 17th. All right, so grabbing our planner and just a nice little reminder of our spread from last week. Here we go. Had that little cute sushi th uh, theme, and it was June 4th through the 10th, and our budget was set at $125. And... I spent, oh yes, I spent $127. So I was over the budget by $2 and some change. And I meant to fill that in exactly, or maybe I did on the back, I'm not sure. I did not. Um, so this week I'm going to try to do a better job of estimating so I don't go over my budget. But it'll all come out in the wash. All right, let's get started okay so I have picked washi tape of course and this washi tape is from uh, recollections and it looks like this it's got the floral it's got that kind of red and uh, reddish coral orangish color and then gold and teal and then so the florals has this wonderful um, kind of peach color in it, kind of blushy, peachy color. So I am going to use that to tie that in. And I'm looking through the washi catalog so I can give you the proper name of the washi tape kit that that came from. So according to the catalog, it came from Blooming Floral, and it's by Craft Smart. Okay, so jumping right in, I know that um, one of my subbies, I think it was Miss Roan, that asked me what was the stamp set called that I used that had the dates. It's just called the, the dates um, stamp set, and this is a part of, I wanna say it's back over, um, if you are in Michaels, it is over where the memory planning things are, and in Hobby Lobby, it's just where the happy planner aisle is and I think I actually got these from Hobby Lobby okay so I am going to be using something that has become a staple for me the colorful uh, boxes sticker book and I'm going to get one of these teal blue stickers and I'm gonna cover up that get the point I'm gonna start there Let's see, that works. It's crooked, but it works. So today is Friday. And this week, I'll tell you, has been so long. It has been a long week. And I'm so happy that it's Friday. And I hope it takes a long, I hope the weekend seems long. All right. So we're gonna put that there so that we can, of course you guys know I always use my meal plan now as an opportunity to improve my stamping skills. So I do have my lovely dovey uh, happy planner stamps, have my stamping block, and I am using colors this week. Let me tell you what I'm using. And let's see if I can do this what's cooking without um, smearing it. So I'm using Scarlet, and this is a Versacolor, and Turquoise, and Seafoam. So those are the colors. I don't know if I'll use Seafoam, but I'm definitely going to be using the Scarlet as I start with this. And as you can see, some of the hot pink last time, from last time, is like really down in the grooves. And as always, I have my handy dandy alcohol-free baby wipes close. All right, 
here we go. Let's see how this comes out. We're going to stamp her right here. Oh yes, nice impression. Love it. Grab the baby wipe. And I'm going to wipe the stamp off the best way I can. And as you can see, the pink being on there did not affect anything. Alrighty. I'm going to put this back. And let that dry at the same time. Okay. So, we want to put the date. So, we'll just write the date up here at top. So it's going to be 6, 11 through 6, 17. Okay. Okay. All right, let's see. I would like to start the sticker one at the bottom and I didn't make my marks this week um, so let's hope that I am able to not only get this straight but you know I get the right amount of uh, rows in here that we need so let's put our budget summary there we are going to use our agenda 52 stickers and we'll use this light color, like the sea foam, to tie that in. So that one looks like I tried to use it before. The budget is going to be set at, and we're going to use red tool pen. I'm going to set it at 135 this week. So this is the budget. And then we'll put the actual here after I'm done with this. I will jump on grocery.walmart.com and place my order for grocery. So this week I didn't use a half sheet. I decided to use, um, this is one of the Glam Girl sticky notes. I'm not showing you my raggedy writing. Um, so for Monday, we are having roasted potatoes and peppers over brown rice, if anyone needs rice. Roasted potatoes. It's at, and sausage, roasted potatoes, sausage, and peppers. And this will be over brown rice. Okay. In the Happy Planner Food Sticker Book, I was able to locate an actual red pepper. It's so cute. And the first time that I've used one in my spread. So I'm going to put it there. And I'm actually going to use something I haven't used. Salt and pepper stickers, I think. Do a little something, something. We're going to go different. Let's, let's commit. Let's go all the way. Tuesday, we're just having regular, uh, we're having taco salad. I was going to say we're having regular. We're not having regular anything. We're having taco salad. And tonight I am using my tool pins. The red one is in fine and the teal one is in medium. So this is going to be taco salad. As you know, it is Taco Tuesday. So I'm going to use the Oh, I'm going to use this Muy Caliente sticker that I wanted to use last week. I'm going to put it here because I have peppers and I have um, tacos. So Muy Caliente. We'll use that. And let's see. I'm going to just grab a taco from our little Happy Planet taco book. So 
and lies our taco salad. All right. On Wednesday, making pasta. So Wednesday is going to be a Tuscan garlic chicken pasta. So it's a creamy, it's creamy. It's creamy Tuscan chicken garlic over pasta and it has spinach and um, spinach and um, roasted um, roasted sun-dried tomatoes it's good it's awesome so you know that on Thursdays we have leftovers and <laughs> any excuse to use this leftover stamp we're going to use it So I'm going to stamp it up and I think I'm going to stamp it up with our turquoise. I think that'll be beautiful. I'll pop this right on out. Let's see. Let's see if we get a nice good impression of the microwave. We should. It's an awesome stamp. There we go. Cover that off. And let's clean our stamp with the alcohol-free baby wipe. All right. Friday is an eat-out type of situation, so let's see if I can find um, an eat-out sticker. It's probably going to be from the new um, little small pack of um, meal planning stickers that came out in a recent Happy uh, Planner release. So I'm going to see if I can pull that one out. And it says, uh, hmm, porch prep eat out. Ah, oh, it's pink. Oh, no, we do have one as blue, but it'll work. It's not quite the right color. You know what? I'm going to cut off that part that doesn't match. And that's exactly what I will do. Mm -hmm. Now, I'll take the sticker is super tiny, but it says eat out, and we can just lay it right here. Beautiful. Saturday, we are having um, Kai's bridal shower is on that day. So, let me see if I can find something that may say, I'm going to put cheers and a drink there. And since it's blushing bride and everything is uh, cheers to our bride and everything is, thing is rosé because that's what I'm eating for dinner, whatever we have from that. Um, let's get a little pink drink, or pink-ish drink, how about that? Let me get this cute little margarita. No, martini. Let's put that there, cute. All right, Sunday, we are having grilled Hulu Huli Huli Chicken. It's a grilled um, chicken marinated in pineapple juice with grilled pineapple. I cannot wait to eat it. So I'm gonna write this with my pen. We're gonna have grilled Huli Huli Chicken. Um, there will be rice. And I'm not sure what we will do for veggies. I'm feeling field peas and snaps. Field peas and snaps. And because it has pineapple in it, you guessed it. Uh, I'm going to put a pineapple. Pop a pineapple right on there. Okay. And it's going to be 
difficult to put it because this is kind of a big pineapple. So I'm going to start it up here near the middle here and kind of put it like a little cat cornered. Come on, boo. All right. All right. So what I'm going to do is set up my um, grocery list on back. And then I'll be back to show you my completed uh, meal plan. And then, as you know, straight to grocery.walmart.com to place that order. All right, so that completes my meal plan for the week of June 11th through June 17th. I have budgeted $135 for groceries. Kind of rather like how this spread came out, even though I had my slow moment challenges. I have completed my grocery list on the back. And I am about to jump on grocery.walmart.com and place my order for groceries. So, give me an update. How are you guys doing on your meal planning? And where are you meal planning nowadays? Are you using um, half sheets? Uh, those menus are, are pretty cool. And, um, you know, I just think I'm going to wing it. If I feel like doing the meal plan in the, in the home uh, expansion kit, then I'll use them. If I don't feel like it, I won't use it. Um, so, it'll be a combination. I'll try to keep changing it up so we don't just get to one used to one way or one thing um thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video if you enjoyed it please give me a thumbs up and if you haven't done so already please subscribe to my channel i hope you have a great week and you stick to your budget and most importantly prepare your family food with love ciao bella